next Saturday sees a double header of junior hurling finals take place at Hastings the Jorns McHale Park in Castlebar. We're going to look to the junior A final first, the meeting of Moy Chora and Ballinat. We hear from Ballinat manager now Noel Burke, who is driving them on for that game next Saturday for sure. The game gets underway from half past six in McHale Park. He's a man originally from Tipperary, but working in Coca-Cola for a long time in the town. So here is uh, Noel Burke speaking to Michael D. McAndrew. Now, the Mayo Junior A final taking place next weekend in McHale Park in Castlebar at half past six on Saturday, August 26th. It's the meeting of Moy Chura and Ballina Stevenites. We'll hear from the Ballina camp now and I'm delighted to say we're joined by their manager, Noel Burke. Uh, Noel, thanks very much for joining us on the programme. It's all systems go now for next weekend and the clash with Moy Chura. How are preparations going? Yeah, thanks Michael for inviting me on. Um, it's great to be on here. Um, yeah, preparations are going well. Um, we're a lot of training now, big numbers at the moment now for we are training there Tuesday night now and we're going to have another um, session there on Saturday. So um, things are going well there. Um, it's been a long enough year, but um, so far so good. Great to see Belna back, so it is Noel, um, after, you know, a g- good absence there. Um, you know, it really is it's fantastic to see uh, hurling again in Stephen Knights. Yeah, it is now, actually. We're back this our third year back, you know, so it's brilliant to get to that county final. Um, and so we had been out of it, like, say, since around 2009 there. But we can believe actually juveniles came in around the same time to Balna. And um, the 2012 juvenile team at Balna, there's actually nine of those players that are um, on the, that are on the panel for um, the weekend of the county final. So that's actually brilliant, you know, because it shows the juveniles are coming through. And um, over the next couple of years, the juveniles um, will come through again. So it's brilliant. That's fantastic. And coupling that then with some of your more experienced guys, guys who would have played years ago as well for Balna, but also guys who have moved into the area from other parts as well. Yeah, we have a, we have a few there. We have um, we've Galway, we have um, we've come from Limerick as well. Um, yeah, so people would have moved in, and myself, I'm actually Prairie, Prairie. So um, yeah, there's there's an influx of different counties involved in this um, for this year anyway. It's great to have people involved. Yeah, so it's, it's very good. And even you know during the year, from people who can't, haven't played with us have actually trained with us. So that has been great as well. You know, people who are working in the town but are playing down home in Clare and also another Galway person. So that, you know that's great for them. They stay around. Yeah, great to have those guys from the Hurling Stronghold, uh, Clare and Galway. You mentioned your Tip Brary man yourself, a native of uh, yeah. Tip. It, it's great to have that uh, Hurling blood in there as well. Yes, they yeah, it is. It's, it's very good, you know. It brings on other lads as well, you know, and suppose with different training techniques and whatever, you know. So it's kind of a, a, a it's, not, it's new for uh, the lads here, and that's nice. Um, every all people from different counties get on great with the lads, you know. Um, we like we've. A great bunch of we've from young to the older, I suppose. What we're probably missing is probably mid twenties up to thirty, but we have older thirties and loads under twenty five as well. So um so yeah, it's unusual I suppose in that way. I suppose it's, the juveniles are just starting to come through the ranks now. Um now there's been a bit of a break there, so we'd be hoping more juveniles from next year on. But um as I had said earlier there you know, there's nine of the current squad would have played juvenile in two thousand and twelve. Yeah, that'll bode well for sure. What about your opponents, Moitura? Uh they really are driving on themselves, like uh, Sean McGahan there, he's a, a man with uh, strong Galway hurling connections, he's our manager and chairman and he's been driving them on and, and they've been going well. Oh yeah, they're going very well now. Um there's actually a, a huge rivalry after building up between ourselves in the last couple of years there. All our matches have been very, very close. I suppose, with the exception maybe of the first round of the league this year, when my tour actually bet us fairly well in Ballina. Um, but we've had two close games since in the league final and in the championship as well. So this will be our actually a fourth time playing in this year. So it's great. Um, it's a great rivalry at the moment. And, you know, it, it are all tough games, but there's not a bad belt between them or not. You know, there's no nothing. The rivalry hasn't done anything like that, you know, so they're always good matches, um, but there's very little um, underhand or anything like that in between. It's just good games for early. Yeah, absolutely. It'll be double header next Saturday in McHale Park and we be hoping for a nice support as well from the Stephen Knights. Yeah, it'd be great, you know, um, I suppose the Stephen Knights are starting this weekend in football, so hopefully there is no football on the following weekend, so hopefully we'll get support from those, but you know, it's great, I suppose we're here just our third year as being part of Stephen Heights, you know, so 
parents have great facilities in Stephen Heights and we have the use of that. So it, it, it's brilliant, you know, and more sport, better. And there is actually some juveniles going to take part at half time. So I know my children have some juveniles and we have juveniles as well. So that will, will bring more people to it. So yeah. I suppose the, the more support, the better on the day. Um, you know, the, the team are really looking forward to it now. Um, the enthusiasm is there. Um, so, you know, it's a great kind of occasion and a great week, two weeks build up to it. Yeah, absolutely. You know, it's, it's very good. Yep, it'll be a great occasion. I wish you the very best of luck. Noel Burke, Balna manager. Thanks for talking to us. Enjoy it next weekend and best of luck. Okay, thank you, Michael.